the Fortnite end of season live event is right around the corner. So, my theory, I'm going to get into my theory in a minute, but I want to start off with the build up we have. We don't have, a, we have a little bit of build up in a form of, we currently have rift beacons around the map, you know, the ones that replaced all the POIs where Halloween areas have taken over, like the Halloween pumpkin biomes have taken over. We also have one rift, the one that restored real, which is perfectly set up and actually aiming directly at the titan. Now, that one's directly at Alien at the Titan, which I'll get into why I think that in a minute. But we've also got more Rift Beacons that actually showed up in the trailer for Fort Nightmares, which means we're going to get more Rift Beacons, which means there's going to probably be more Rift Beacons building up to you know, the Fortnite, the end of Fort Nightmares and the end of season event. Probably that's what this is teasing. Um, why I think the Rift Beacon, that Rift Beacon is pointing directly towards the Titan Hand, I think Hope and Joes are going to use that Rift Beacon to actually fire at the direction of the arm, the Titan arm. And then they're going to free the Titan from the ground. Now, why? To fight Dr. Victor Von Doom. That is why. The reason why I think that is because I think Dr. Doom will be returning. He was rifted around. He's back to reality 616. And I believe that he'll be coming back to the island to fight Hope and Jones. But this time they'll have the Titan on their side. And the Titan will, well, not necessarily on their side, but they just use it. They've just reawakened it. And it'll be fighting against Doom's against Doom. Doom will probably ultimately win in the end against the fight, in the fight against the Titan, and it will leave Hope and Jones kind of screwed as to what to do next. Luckily, I think Iron Man will be constructing a time machine to bring us back to Chapter 2, and we will go back there, we'll go take the time machine and go back to Chapter 2. Iron Man will construct a time machine. Now I think they will use that final rift beacon to actually fire at Doom, zap him basically, like uh, attack him basically, and use it to basically take the rift the Pandora powers out of him, Last time they attempted to rift him back, they, the way they rifted him back, but they didn't actually get rid of Pandora's power. This time they'll get rid of Pandora's power out of him, and send Pandora's power for a controlled rift, you know, the power so it doesn't plague their universe. And Doom will be there powerless without Pandora's power, it's still with his power, and they'll use the rift beacon again, rift him back to 616. But I think in this fight, at some point in this fight, I think that Doom and the Titan, at some point they're fighting, I think the Zero Point will end up being exposed. I think Zero Point has been mentioned a little bit, I think, in the files. Um, and I think, as a result, the Zero Point will be weakened and they need to go back to Chapter 2 for a specific reason to basically help heal the Zero Point or something to heal the Zero Point and there's something in Chapter 2 that will help them do that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share and subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Oh, the power of Pandora's box is leaving them. Oh my god, oh. no. Why don't they not? Why don't they not? Why don't they end? And then he's what? Gone. No, he's masked. I think. Thank what you. is that? Oh my god, the mask! Or oh, did he just drop? Is that his mask? Yeah. Oh. Mask. He died. That was cool. Wait, so what happens Why now? Why do I stop screaming? I don't get it. That's his mask. He's not. Well, it's open now.